of the actors that you work with, uh, with uh, on the show? Oh, oh, it's really nice. I mean, I don't know if you guys have met, uh, you know, have seen Kelly Blatz who played Aaron Stone and David Lambert. I mean, they're very gorgeous. <laughs> so, <laughs> so you're lucky. <laughs> it's really nice. It's fun. It's nice to work with uh, good-looking people. <laughs> That's I mean, good. yeah, you know, I mean, and they are really nice too. Mm -hmm. But it, it's nice because sometimes, you know, I get scenes, I get to kiss one of the boys, and uh, <laughs> and um, <laughs> you know, anyway. <laughs> um, from all the movies that you played, from all your roles that you've had, which one would you say is your favorite, and why? Oh, let's see. Um, I have to say the. Uh, well, hold on. <laughs> I mean, I think the the ones that I've done, I I really do enjoy the uh, dark Tamara Emma character in Aaron Stone mm -hmm. because you know I get to play a superhero and a girl next door at the same time, so it's really unique, and we get to try like crazy outfit, and I get to use lots of different kinds of weaponries. Uh -huh. um, I don't know, I really enjoy that. And you get to fight too. Mm -hmm. I wow. know. <laughs> oh, and um, Disney is really nice. You know, they he gave they gave me training with one of the best trainers in the world. So Kelly Blatz and I we trained with him for about two weeks, and I think I lost like eight pounds. Wow, which is really nice. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's cool though. So if ever you're in trouble, you can. Fight your way out of it, and you can protect yourself. Yeah, yeah. Or just call nine one one. Exactly. Know. <laughs> um, who has been the biggest influence in your acting career? My biggest influence. influence? You mean like actors, or yeah. I think anybody, just who's like supported you throughout your career, and who's made you want to work harder. Oh, all right. Well, I think my biggest supporter would be myself. <laughs> oh, that's a good No, because one. it's true, you know, yeah. sometimes um, you have, what I do is like when I get discouraged, I would like go to the beach or something and just be by myself and quiet my mind and, you know, talk to myself, kind of like talk to yourself, <laughs> but hopefully no one sees it, so <laughs> you don't look crazy. And then I would, uh, usually I would be able to find the answer and uh, encourage myself to, you know, do whatever I need to do. But other than that, um, my acting coaches have been really wonderful to me. Um, they have taught me so many things and always gives gives me inspiration. And also my fellow actors in my acting class, and also people who are at work. Um, there are a lot of people. I think everyone in my life, uh, I would say 99% of everyone in my life are very positive and supportive of my really career. Good. Wow! So deep. including my cats. Oh, that's so cute. How many cats do you have? I have two cats, uh -huh. and I think they're... I know you may think I'm crazy, but I think they're my best friends. Because <laughs> you can talk to them all you want, and they won't ever shout at you, they won't ever get mad at you, so you can tell them everything. You can tell them everything, and they love you unconditionally, um, <laughs> and you can sleep with them all day long. It's really nice. You yeah. have a dog, right? Yes. So that's why you understand. I talk to her all the time. <laughs> Okay, two crazy girls. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> so, has this been a like a childhood dream to act, or just when you came to the U.S.? Definitely not a childhood dream because I was never exposed in. Um, when I was in Bandung, I knew nothing about acting or. I actually, when I watch TV, I thought they're real, like they're happening now. <laughs> I didn't know that they're actors or things like that. I, it really was a Disneyland um, uh, audition was my first exposure to what acting is. Uh -huh. And I was very happy to, you know, to get that. Have you, did you go to Disneyland before the commercial? Never. Never? And that's what happened too because um, when I booked the part, I wasn't the lead or anything. Mm -hmm. And there were like 17 people and I was just in the background, you know, ah, stuff. But then after we ride the roller coaster for 17 times or so, uh, all the lead guys are uh, nauseous and they threw up. And I was the only one who's very cheery because I've never <laughs> been to Disneyland. So the director asked me to be the lead in the commercial and hired me for two more commercials. And that's when um, I realized how awesome the job exactly. is. Yeah. So.